Do you have boxes of these kind of like flat back pearls and rhinestones? Well, I need a better way to store them because I just have the lid open, like a little hole cut in the top. And this one, I just cut a little top, but my kittens get in there and they like to dig them out. And because they're so big that I've got them stacked up on a tall shelf and I'm not using them. So when I was at the Dollar Tree, I saw this pill box and my thinking is I'll be able to store this vertically in a kind of like, you know, a desk tidy type container. Um, and so the lid is going to lock so I can store them upright and I'll be able to just open it up, see what colors I have. I might glue some of the colors to the outside. We'll see, but I pretty much just want to cover up this days of the week on the top. So the supplies I'm going to use is this is something from the hardware store. You can usually find this where they do the heating and air conditioning duct work. It's aluminum. It's a very, very thin aluminum that has sticky tape on the back. Very, very sticky tape. Okay, sticky tape. Let me cut a little piece off. Very sticky. So I'm thinking that's going to stick to the plastic really good. I'm actually going to emboss it and then cut it out to where these are going to fit and cover up my days of the week. All right. Let's get started. All right, I just used my hand to estimate how much I'm gonna need, and I'm gonna run this through the embossing folder. I do have my own sandwich that I use. I'm not using any extra plates because embossing folders are thicker than dies. And I just moved the embossing folder down until I got the whole piece embossed. I've got a scrap piece of paper and I'm just using my fingers and a ruler to basically emboss it and make an impression into the top of that individual opening of the lid. And then I'm using that as a template to cut out the aluminum tape. I wanna make this really simple and really fast. I'm noticing that when I open them, I can still see the days of the week. So I just grabbed what I already had sitting on my workstation, which is the back side of the tape that keeps it from being sticky. Okay, that is what the inside looks like. That's what the outside looks like. And the glue that I used is a very heavy industrial grade glue and it looks like it's pulling the plastic printing from the day of the week. It looks like that was printed on the inside, um, but I don't think it's gonna damage anything. It looks like it's just, um, what do you call it? like colored or distressed. So that's gonna take some time to dry. This glue needs a lot of setup time, but it's very strong. So in about 24 hours, that should be set up. And now I'm gonna put some pearls in here.
Wow, that is going to be so much easier to store because I can store it upright. But I hope you've enjoyed this project. Thank you for spending some time with me. Hope you got inspired. If you learned something or just liked this video a little bit, please give it a thumbs up. That's how YouTube knows that you enjoyed watching me. And if you don't give it a thumbs up, nobody enjoys watching me and they don't recommend the video to anybody else. So that's my project for today. It was a very quick make. And now you can have time to do more crafting and be organized. <laughs>